Good morning. We are doing another visual podcast of In Our Neighborhood. We are currently here in front of Meadowlark School with Kim from United Way and my partner Janet Duffy from Comparion Insurance Agency. I'll let Janet kind of take it away and ask the questions that we want to know <laughs> to promote this wonderful event. There you go. Thanks, Todd, and welcome, Kim. We're indeed in front of Metal Art School, so I'm going to try to use my big girl voice today because there's <laughs> traffic behind us, which we love because that means that people are coming and going and maybe curious about what we're doing. We're here to talk specifically about Step the Bus Yeah. Um, for United Way. There's a lot happening. We were talking before we went on on camera about this is kind of your time with United Way where you do a lot of planning and stuff the bus is yeah. kind of the launching point for yeah. some of that. Yeah, absolutely. So United Way has been doing our stuff the bus school supply drive for 13 years now. Um, and over that time it is just grown. And what I love about stuff the bus is it's just a really community wide event. Um, this is a chance for folks to give school supplies, um, but also living essentials, um, because we know that if kids don't have soap, um, they're not also not going to be ready for school. So we collect things like toothbrushes and toothpaste, soap and shampoo, things like that, as well as all the things that you think about for school. Um, and over the years that we've been doing Stuff the Bus, um, the list of school supplies has gotten longer and unfortunately more expensive. Um, so United Way gathers school supplies um, and gives them to, to local kids through local nonprofits, um, through the school district, and then also through a new event, which is the Back to School Blast, which is super exciting. So do you want to... Um so, Steph the Bus, where is the bus located yeah. that people can make their donations to? Right, so um, we'll have three buses. Um, we'll be at Target and both Walmarts on August 10th from 8 a.m. till 5.30. Um, and then, it, but if people can't donate school supplies that day, of course they can get school supplies to us before or after, and we'll make sure to get those to local kids. Awesome. So. Um, the new event. I'm yeah. not sure what is it called. Back to School Back Blast. To, okay, yeah. awesome. So can you talk about yeah. that a little yeah, bit? Yeah, absolutely. Um, so over the years, um, there's been school supply um, kind of backpack giveaways. The rescue mission had a backpack giveaway. Alliance for Youth um, started a backpack giveaway. Well, two years ago, um, basically all the entities got together and said, we just need to have one big event right um and 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 have since been like honestly we worked a, probably a year in advance um raising money collecting school supplies getting the orders in planning the event um and it's turned into this just kind of massive event where literally kids can get everything they need to get ready for school oh, so, so they'll great. get a stuffed backpack free haircuts um, there's free food, wow. there's so um, cool. immunizations, um, sports physicals, everything. everything. Like just imagine <laughs> what a kid needs to get ready for school. Right. Um, and everything's right in one building um, at the Civic Center on August 18th. Oh, great. Yeah, it's oh really gosh. exciting. Um, it's just a ton of fun too. So teamwork it's, makes the dream work. Yeah, exactly. exactly, yeah, absolutely. So you literally have um, you know, entities, United Way, um, Alliance for Youth and Rescue Mission are really lead drivers in the event. Um, but the Realtors Association, Town Pump, um, you know, all sorts of Alluvian, all sorts of entities coming together to help kids um, get ready to succeed once school starts. That's awesome. So is that the day that the items are given to the, the Yeah, kids? so if kids so, want a backpack, okay. um, they can register now, um, okay. but also um, they can walk into the event on August 18th. Um, nice. So certainly if you know somebody that needs a backpack, uh, we want to make sure that every kid has one um, so they can, can individuals can get those supplies at the Back to School Blast. And where um, do they register for that? So they can register at Opportunities Inc. Okay. Um, and they can just call, um, see if I can remember the number, 406-761-0310. Okay. But um, it's well, Opportunities Inc. We can put the graphic up 
that that's the easiest <laughs> double test double way. check my, right. my phone number. Yeah, yeah. Um, well, I'm sure pretty so. sure I've got it memorized, but you never know. Right. <laughs> so so how do folks we know about stuff the bus and yeah. you know people can donate school supplies and such, but yeah. how do they help with the the school blast? Yeah, so basically um, there's a website um, B the number two S blast.org and honestly to make an event like this happen we need hundreds of volunteers right. if you're not available to volunteer on the 18th um, we'll be stuffing backpacks ahead of time we'll have set up the day before um, so really lots of opportunities need, yeah really we need hundreds of volunteers so people right. can go to that website um, they can sponsor a student through the website um, but they can also volunteer any way that they want to get involved. Literally, some, an event like this takes hundreds of people. I can oh my imagine. gosh, that's so cool. Yeah, I'm really yeah. it's exciting. It's so yeah. much fun and just wow. the energy in the room and to see, last year we gave away more than 1,000 backpacks. Wow, yeah. that for, is amazing. Go great for a first year event, that's just outstanding. So. And it just gives that kids that extra boost of yeah, we're energy honest. and right. yeah. esteem and yeah. everything that they need that they have for school. Yeah, absolutely. And honestly, I just love this event. Um, Shields hooks us up with backpacks, at, like incredible backpacks at a really affordable price. Oh, that's cool. um, Congratulations, Shields. Thank I know. <laughs> so we really appreciate that. But honestly, I think that makes a big difference that if you are giving kids the same backpack that that the uh, you know that the that kid that can afford, afford it, it can right. have absolutely um, you know just imagine the difference that that makes the the day they walk into school. Yeah, um, it gets rid of that stigma for the yeah. child. Well, yeah, it's really so, important to us. Yeah, I mean, I just can't imagine being yeah you know just that kid if, that if, that's really like their comparisons are so harsh. And so that's yeah. great. Yeah, if you're a kid in need, you're already you know kind of have that feeling about you know you have that apprehension about school right if you're a kid that's struggling right. um, school isn't necessarily something you're excited, excited for about. right and so to give them everything they need to feel like they can charge through those doors and that school is something that's and awesome and exciting, the world. yeah that's that's what we're trying to deliver um, and we know that kids in our community more than half of the kids in our Great Falls Public Schools are on free and reduced lunch right, right. more than half and in some schools it's a hundred percent yeah um so with with stuff the bus with the back to school blast we make sure um to get the kids most in need right. and make sure that they're ready to succeed that they have everything that they need to succeed in school at, li at least eliminate some barriers yep. for them that's Absolutely. awesome I the things that our community yeah. can do right we can do this Right, and we commend United Way and the other organizations, organizations. that are getting yeah. together to make this possible. That is so exciting. Yeah. Is there anything else that you would like to share about what's happening? At, and this big, there's a big truck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Florida big Express, truck. the Long Island yeah. distance. <laughs> I'm not sure where they're going. <laughs> well, so we ask um, businesses to do stuff the bus school supply drives. Um, so between now and August 10th, we have a lot of businesses that are doing drives. Then they bring those supplies to our buses on August 10th. Um, so people can find everything that they need to run a supply drive, the, the supplies that we're collecting, That's the awesome. most needed supplies. Right. They can find all that on our website. As well as make personal donations if they're Absolutely. not attached to yeah. a business. Absolutely, Maybe. yep. Yeah. That's and on the website great. as well. Yep. What is that website again? So um, the United Way website is uwccmt.org. So you can find everything you need for really for both events at that Great, website. great. So just to kind of culminate this, the, the Stuff the Bus is where you do the collection of the supplies. Absolutely. And then the Back to School Blast is kind of, and prior to that, yeah. is where you put the backpacks together and kind of deliver the product that yep. you collected. Yep, absolutely. So if, if individuals want to give, um, please t you know help us out with Stuff the Bus. Um, and then just know that, that the kids in need are getting those supplies. You know, we work with local nonprofits like the YWCA, among others, yeah. um, to, get, to get those supplies to kids in need. Um, and then also the public schools. And then, of course, if you're a kid in need, 
join us at the Back to School Blast. Right. If you oh. want to volunteer, there's so many volunteer right. opportunities right now. Well, I think you can count Comparion in on something. <laughs> Absolutely. So you guys Absolutely. Are <laughs> That's yeah. right. Um, the other thing that we want to mention, we're standing in front of the bus, <laughs> yes. not only for Stuff the Bus, but Big Sky Bus Lines is advertising and they're in need of, 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 bus, of drivers. bus drivers yeah, desperately. Absolutely. So we hope that you take that into consideration. Honestly, Big Sky Bus Lines has been an amazing partner for 13 years of Stuff the Bus. Um, we've asked them kind of more and more every year, can we get another bus? Right. Can you help us? I um, remember this? when it was one bus. It was one bus. <laughs> now it's three. It's grown <laughs> three. Yeah. So I really can't say enough about right. Big Sky Bus Lines and their support of this effort. Um, so they've been great. And honestly, the need for school bus drivers is, is high. So I can put on my school <laughs> trustee hat <laughs> and right. tell you that there is a need for for school bus drivers um, so that our kids can get to school. Yes. We want them to get, to have the backpacks. We also want to get, <laughs> get them to school too. That's important. Yeah, yeah. Education is important. Yeah, absolutely. Well, thank you very much for helping us out today absolutely. and getting the good word spread on this great event. And we'd like to thank everyone in the community for participating and let's go out and have a wonderful new school year. Yeah, Thanks. stuff the bus everybody, August <laughs> 10th. And back to school, school last. And the back to school last August 18th. <laughs> awesome. Thanks so much.